In honor of Police Week, one local business is paying tribute to fallen officers here in the Valley. Nevada Coin Mart is hosting a pop-up store to support the Injured Police Officers Fund. 13 Action News anchor Rachel Moore live from the event taking place later this morning. Rachel. Well, Dave, you might remember the officer who was killed last year from COVID-19. Well, this fund is to help families like his, and the owner of this coin mart says that you don't even have to buy anything here. Just coming out to support our local law enforcement is enough. Baseball caps, coffee mugs, and even official Las Vegas Golden Knights gear. These are just some of the items up for sale at the pop-up store for the Injured Police Officers Fund an organization with a mission to help the families of fallen officers. In Nevada, we unfortunately had two officers that were fallen. Nevada Coin Mart owner Neil Sackmary is talking about Lieutenant Eric Lloyd, who passed away last July after his battle with COVID-19, and Sergeant Ben Jenkins, who was killed when he stopped to help a driver on the side of the road. Zach Mary says helping heroes in Las Vegas is his passion. They put their lives on their line every single day for us. And so it's really important that we give them honor. Since 1982, the IPOF has been holding fundraisers to honor fallen officers, providing monetary assistance to loved ones they've left behind. Zach Mary saw the importance of recognizing local law enforcement, urging the community to see the officers behind the badge. They're not just always just big, strong men and women. You know, they, they, they have heart, and sometimes things really affect them. Nevada Coin Mart is partnering with LVMPD as well as the Las Vegas Golden Knights to pay tribute to fallen officers. The pop-up store approved by the Charitable Board of Las Vegas Metro Police. That means patrons can be sure their donations are going to help local heroes. All the officers from all the different agencies, you know, it's a real showing of support and solidarity. Now this pop-up store happening between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. here on Flamingo and Jones at the Coin Mart. And the owner says that even a portion of the proceeds purchased from his store will go to the fund. Reporting live, Rachel Moore, 13 Action News.